video today. Um, the other video I did about inserting online video seemed to be quite popular, so I'm going to do a uh, inserting online pictures video. So you're in PowerPoint, and let's say I needed to insert picture of, well, let's, I'm going to do a TV, a picture of a TV. So instead of going to Google, starting up, you know, the web browser, searching Google Images or Bing or whatever your preferred search engine is, you could just go to the Insert tab in PowerPoint, choose Online Pictures, and right now it's a Bing image search. You could also insert pictures from social media, um, or you can do um, your cloud storage. But if I did a Bing Bing image search, I'm going to search for TV. You notice a bunch of them pop up. Uh, now it says search results are images licensed under Creative Commons. Okay, so we could review the uh, the license agreements if we wanted to. Well, let's say I want to use that TV insert. There it goes, puts it in. Now, uh, once you do that, a couple things can happen. Now, depending on the type of image, JPEG or PNG, you might have white space involved. And don't forget, um, in PowerPoint, we do have uh, remove background features, which I'll talk about in another video. But if you want to insert online pictures, it's just insert online pictures. You do your search. It comes up with a bunch of different image choices. You choose the one you want, you hit insert, it downloads it and puts it into your, into your PowerPoint presentation. 